Hi, this is Ala from Vomoplants.com. In this video, we're going to review a few more Kali's cultivars. We're also going to compare young plan to mature plan so you can see the difference and have a better understanding of what to expect when you're ordering a young startup plant. Let's zoom in to our first beauty, Magenta Sunrise. This Kalias has medium sized green to yellow scalloped leaves with hot pink center and burgundy speckles that shade the leaf beautifully. Next to it is everyone's favorite henna. Henna has medium sized chartreuse leaves with copper shading and beautifully laced edges. The more light henna gets, the more copper it leaves turn to the point that the whole bush can turn into this flaming color. Next to Hannah is Kalia's Dark Ruffles with its large deep purple leaves and beautiful laced edges. Next to it is Kalia's Lord Voldemort. It has medium sized scalloped leaves with the deep purple shading and a thin lime green border. The veins are very defined that gives it this distinct look. The plant next to it may look like the dark ruffles that we just saw, but it's actually bright ruffles. Bright ruffles has the thin lime green border on the edge of the leaf, while the dark ruffle leaf is solid purple and a larger size. Dark ruffles has more blue in its color, while bright ruffles has more red and the leaves are less wavy. Next to bright ruffles is the green colorless cultivar, Wild Lime. It has large lime green leaves with laced edges and yellow speckles throughout the leaf. Hiding behind Wild Lime, we have a Kingswood Torch. It has gorgeous wine leaves with hot pink center and just a touch of green on the serrated edges. Next to it is Kalia's Dipped in Wine. It has large chartreuse leaves shaded in deep red, burgundy and purple. So now when we made a full circle, let's compare young and mature plants of the same cultivars. Here we have a young plant for magenta sunrise and the sunlight just changed and gave us different shade but the young plant has greener leaves, the veins are not defined and we just have a strokes of color on the leaf which is very different from the mature plant. This one is a young henna plant. Unlike the mature plant, it has a greener leaves, no copper shading yet, and under leaf has just a hint of copper. If we put it close together, we see that it's the same plant. But in order to get to desired color, henna needs time to mature and also a good amount of direct sunlight. The young dark ruffles plant looks like adult plant in terms of the color, but the leaves are less wavy and the new growth and the new leaves are usually green. But as it matures, it gets into its true colors pretty fast. Lord Voldemort is my favorite transformation uh, which you can experience growing colors. As you can see, the young plant is nothing like the glorifying beauty of the adult plant. It does have the hints of colors of the adult plant. It's a lime green with purple, but it's lacking the pattern of the leaf that it's so recognizable when you are talking about Lord Voldemort. As you can see, Kalius is a very entertaining plant to grow as it changes every day. Sign up for more videos.